No, she's already played Brad. So she'd be on the other side, so it'd be Brad versus Cloud, probably? Yeah, yeah Brad versus Cloud. Unless Caleb beat him. But. Whoever, um, Brad against McLeod or, assuming yeah, assuming you beat Cap uh, Caleb. We have. Oh, yeah, Brad. Rest of five. You won one set. It's all in your kitty, baby. Gotta love top six, best of five in a eight player tournament. Oh, yeah. Let's see. There we go. Yeah, that's a better one. What do we got? Straddle. And. I McLeod. assume McLeod, yeah. It will be Peach White. Also for comms, we have. <laughs> so I think it's going to be a really close set. It wasn't, uh, from what I gathered, it wasn't that. Actually, you know, it was three-one last time they played. Um, but I, I think it'll be close than that this time. McLeod's on the come up. He's improving quite a bit. Yeah. Do you think he's better than Catherine yet, or? It depends on the matchup, I think. Yeah, that's I think, fair. I think it's very much... Um, actually, to be honest... They're I very probably, similar at skill level. I would probably put Kafrin, um in the Fox, like above McLeod in the Fox matchup, to be honest. I always find Kafrin, but that could also be like Kafrin being more comfortable playing. Well, yeah, that's against, playing against you, because yeah, she plays your bunch. Um, what are we waiting on here? Where is McLeod? Oh, he's getting his drink. He's okay, yeah, fair. McLeod has a nice new haircut. He's yep. He's looking. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm, I'm thinking back to like some of the old, um, like some of the winter tournaments when he was wearing that, like you know, that vest. Oh, yeah, 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 and he yeah. had the like he looked like an angry Russian or something. Um, was... Yeah, now he looks like a background person in Greece. Ooh, to be fair, you had to, you know... I mean, they're, they're getting paid well. They, Half of chat would want to be there. Yeah. As long as they, you know, get to put the earplugs in. Wait, Grease is in, like, the TV show? The movie or whatever movie? it was, yeah. Okay. Because there was a, um, TV... Oh, was it? There was a TV series about a, um... Called Grease on, like, ABC. Oh. Um... That was no some, like, that. college... Yeah. Alright, let's get... Oh, no, how, do, how do we hit one of these? I keep yeah. looking at like sources, but when I'm looking, I'm like, why isn't it, why isn't it doing anything? All right, let's. Uh, no, what are, yeah, what are should, you doing? We should hit no, one of these. Mirror. Ones. We're doing hand warmers. I mean, I guess yeah. It's like, well, it's one of the, right. one of these. This way we can see our yeah, our, that our happy faces. Ow. We can see there. We can yeah, see the we players. Can see That's true. Yeah. You um, get it all. McLeod looking very focused. I mean, I would too if I asked like that. Brad, um... <laughs> I love what... Like, Loki, I love watching, like, Brad's, um, face in, like, camps. He just... Hmm? Uh, I think on stream next, probably. Um... Actually, I say that, but it's the best of... It's the best of five, Peach Samus. Ooh. Yeah. Could be best three. I mean... Oh, uh, wait, he's going Falcon, three. never mind. He's going Falcon, yeah. All of a sudden, we do want that on stream. Right, I got him. Yeah, we got there. Every time. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, cool. Okay, so destruct the fountain. Actually, yeah. that makes sense for Brad. He's always struck Peach to um, fountain. At least right, yeah, he likes the small space. It makes sense. Actually, did Catherine and Brad? You and they um, went to Fountain Game 1? I have no idea. I was not here until uh, the second set of the day. Sure. Um, ooh, really good, like... You just grabbed him, dude. You well, no, jumped at him and grabbed. The reason why it was good is because... Um, like, McLeod was definitely expecting um, Brad to land with, like, a bear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, yeah. So, you know, definitely a good grab, like... Down. 
down. Yeah, Peach can't really cover the top platform well. Yeah, top plat sucks. And <laughs> when you're Peach, top plat is a mistake. Hey, top when platform you're, when sucks when you're Peach, but they won't ever take you to stay. Really? No. Wait, what? No. <laughs> it's Peach. Oh, I mean, yeah, yeah. It's like, it's like it's all they're all high and mighty about not liking top platform, but they won't go to the only other stage if you ban a D. Give me like a top plat where I don't die. <laughs> I don't <laughs> die to an up smash at like 80. Or 70. Dude, we had that at PAL and they said not take us there. We've taken foxes out. Say us. Yeah. Place Fox in this matchup. I don't like getting crouch cancelled to oblivion trying to shine people. Yeah, really is an execution test until a certain point. Yeah. And if you can't meet it, then... Oh, no, no, I'm locked outside of that. Alright, I'll tell Oh, okay, yeah. It Holding the troops right now, Kai. We'll see how effective it is. Yep, we got Ruben going down. Don't they normally just leave the thingy out there? That sucks. Mm. Yeah. Oh, big money. Yeah. <laughs> bit of, bit of stuttering, bit of um, yeah, yeah. flubs in movement, but. Got a lot of the miss ledge dash into. Oh, they let me get to ledge again. Immediately hit a good one. Yeah. yeah. Right, and Kai is snuck back in. Yeah, we rescued him. <laughs> oh, really bad dash attack. Bye. Uh, oh, that's worst drill. <laughs> Whoa, what he, he wants to up smash. I wonder why. Yeah. That's unfortunate. Um, because I don't think. I'm not sure if that drill into Shine was actually true. No, it wasn't, yeah. but I think what happened was McLeod was trying to SDI it out mm. and got caught in the... Wait, I SDI, but they keep drifting towards me. Uh, yeah. Um, but I guess... Uh, oh, what? Yeah, I won. I won, yeah, you're right. Um, yeah, you do get to go to FD, though, which is always nice. You know, man, getting a grab is hard against spaces. <laughs> It makes up for the fact that you have one of the absolute easiest train grabs that gets like a yeah, free yeah. 80, but yeah, it's not the most free yeah. below 20. Below it's 20, no Ganon did a chain grab, that's right. for sure. <laughs> um. I'm surprised Brad didn't put out a backer there, just other things. Well, doesn't really matter. Yeah, you just. Sometimes you just flick up on the other stick and the other guy dies at 80, you know, normal stuff. And if you're then going to come in and use shield, then you flick. Well, I guess well, you, you have flip to hit both, both sticks. sticks, yeah. What a complex character. Uh, I wonder if, like, when, like, Fox Nine and Hubert there, I think Hubert could have gotten a grab, but That's I think a, Adam still would have just been, like, really surprised. Yeah. yeah. Surprised that Side B hit him. Look, he was going straight over, I guess. Brad knows the Side B hitbox better than I do. Probably more important for him to know it as well. Yeah. Okay, yeah. I guess he knew. I wouldn't have just been pulling a tournament swing. Whatever, I would have yeah, been you, very, you, you would have been very panically grabbing the ledge and repression. Yep. Oh, this is going to be really big. Yeah. Bad DI, but I guess he was trying to shine out. Yeah, probably. Also, I guess not the greatest spacing. I mean, it worked out there because he got sent the other way, but in general, yeah. I think you want to go to like, the middle of the stage. Yeah, Brad also didn't do the... Um, hold down. <laughs> okay. Oh, risky, risky stuff, but you know, that's Brad yeah. sometimes, God bless yeah, him, you he loves to go out and... Sometimes you've got to take an absurd risk to kill a guy at 100. Mm -hmm. A lot of time you don't though. <laughs> a lot of time you wish you do that to kill a guy at zero. How's this? I don't know, it felt like he was going to die at 60 then. How's this feature coming down? I don't know, you should have picked a sandwich with platforms. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Look, give me like imagine Dream Lampy's takeaway top flat. <laughs> yeah. Like God bless that that well. And in the ideal Fox world, it's the like upside down battlefield from um, the adventure mode. 
<laughs> it's like smaller than Yoshi's somehow. Yeah. yeah. Man. What's Corneria? Bring back Corneria. Please. Oh, uh, the, what's that? Um, that one Kirby stage. Uh, green, green greens? Green greens, yeah. <laughs> I'm just picturing like... Hey, the bombs are there. It's fair and balanced. <laughs> yeah. Well, we're probably going back. We went back to FD last time they played. Uh, was, yeah. yeah. Sounds about right. Red was two up. On game three, on a cloud one. Will he do it again? Well, Who he's, knows? you got to think it's either that or go to... Um, FOD, right? FOD, yeah. Well, he did pretty well on FOD. Oh, grab. Okay. Yeah, well. I was about to say. Oh, no. You only get so many grabs. You can't be... You can't be floating it <laughs> after you get one. I mean, he took his jump, it was fine. Yeah, I guess well, he killed him. Oh. Just like when Fox goes for up smash in the duo here, it's like, oh no, he's not chain grabbing, he didn't kill him, and then the other Fox can't land anyway. Yeah. Just kind of gets, <laughs> just kinda gets the combo, like, hits him with a couple of, like, hits him with a back throw or two and hits an edge guard. It's like, okay, yeah, I guess. Look, up smash is better than trying to do, you know, tr it's better than a messed up option, but, you know. Yeah, it's if still a 20% and, and a tech chase. Yeah. Like, that's well, the thing people forget. Yeah, it's like, it's if you can hit two tech chases with Fox, you don't need the chain grab. It's quite good if you, like, if you're nervous and you can hit the tech chase. Um, it's those percents where, when they're like 60 or 70, where it just doesn't, yeah, it pops them really up. Good yeah. He yeah. kind of goes out there and puts himself right in all the spots. Crap on up there. Mm. Peach, I can edge guard. <laughs> what is this? Not an SA. Not an SA. We don't have oh the pivot, <laughs> the pivot F tilt. Oh my <laughs> god, that was a combo and a half. Jesus. Brad kind of just nods. He's like, yeah. He's like, all right. Yes, he didn't need to chain grab me here. Yeah, I think this stock is important for Brad to take to just kind of stop the momentum going into game four. Like it shouldn't matter too much because he should just you know take it to stay in the win. But yeah, I know if I'm Brad at this point, I'm thinking to myself, all right, you messed up a bunch. Yeah, you know, let's take. Um, just take the stock. Take, uh, pick um, a good stage and yeah. win three one. Brad might be thinking, well, if I just don't get hit for two stocks. Yeah, that and I'll smash a bunch. Ah, right, boys. Well, yeah. Well, oh, that's such a bad feeling. It's like I'm free. Oh, I'm free. Oh. <laughs> Particularly if you buffer something, expecting them to hit it. Okay, so okay. <laughs> McLeod at this point has just given up on up throw and. Is now just f Um I don't know. I would. I think up throw Nair is still true at like that percent. Oh, so this is, yeah. you know, yeah, up throw Nair is definitely a good combo to be pulling out at this juncture. Mm. Oh, that's yeah. yeah. Maybe not. Maybe it doesn't work. Not sure if that was just him messing up the arm. Um, Might have also dash. been the like extra percent from the. Doesn't matter. Really like yeah. this point. Oh, Four yeah. throw is. Bound to happen sooner or later. Yeah. Peach telling everyone this is fun. McLeod's face. Hey. It's not fit. <laughs> yeah, this is not. Not it. saying that this has been a fun set for no. all involved so far. He's closing his eyes, taking a deep breath. He's going to stadium. Up smashes. Actually, also like up smashes isn't going to kill like that much earlier than um, FD. Yeah, I was about to say yeah. FD is like stage is scary. The big thing is just it has all like the downsides of FD, but yeah. um, with out no, the chain grab. No, none of the chain grab and somehow more space for Fox to run. And occasionally Fox gets the wall. Yeah, sometimes you get what, the fire transformation and you just or the rock. Beat. Or the rock, yeah. Yeah, when Fox is on the side of the rock and like it doesn't matter what you hit him, he's just gonna bounce off in tech. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, such yeah. a bad feeling, especially when he's at like high percent. You gotta move to like 140, the tree comes out, and you're just like, oh, here we go. Yeah, to be honest, I don't like that's the like one time where I don't blame Hbox for like playing. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You wanna plank that out, you know? Like, I think it's the sort of thing where if there wasn't the bottom bit, he'd probably try to go under the stage, and get <laughs> on the other side of the yeah. tree. Oh. Like, I don't, yeah. Like, you can't really blame him for planking there. Like, you. You know, if Future King was still playing at this point and there was money on the line, he'd be seeing the ledge forward airing and up being and shit. 
Hey, Mewtwo King's face, he's back. Sort of. He's entered like two tournaments. Well, that's <laughs> <He's out>. <laughs> when you're fresh out of college and you have got nothing for your resume. Genesis 33rd. <laughs> nothing else. Hey man, he's our like hope and savior against um well one of our hope and well, yeah, saviors against like, Hbox right now. Against Hbox at the moment, which yeah. is like that's big. That's really impressive for a guy that hasn't played for nine months. Imagine how many sets PPMD will win. Mm. I really like that reverse, that like strong reverse bear there, because um, it was definitely mixing. Like uh, Brad was not expecting at all to have to tech, so oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. It just mixes up, mixes them up, and yeah, I'm, I'm guessing he was expecting something like a air. Probably. What's he gonna do? He's gonna miss Waveland. That's a big thing. Like Brad was in the corner a bit before, and then just goes to side plat, jumps over. Yeah. Um, Can't really do that on FD. No. Ah, uh, escape these... options are reasonably limited there. I think the problem here is that like McLeod is trying to be like float Nair. I'm pretty sure you can just like dash full hop Nair. And it's not like you need to like. You you save some frames if you had done a float Nair as opposed to like a full hop Nair, but it doesn't matter because you're not comboing. Yeah, they got, the like, goal is to get the hit. It doesn't yeah, matter. Them, like, oh. Alright, right, how are we getting out of this corner? No, we're not. Cause the Fox is just... Uh, oh, this could be huge. Good way. Yeah, that's a big combo. That's 60% Brad didn't need. Right, so McLeod needed, though, and now he's back in it. Now the rock. Not. We got the safety rock. That was smart from the cloud, yeah. Oh no. Yeah. Oh, he, uh, yeah, the thing is, I'm... Good. Yeah. Good. He's actually, oh no, oh. yeah. That's the thing, you get pushed back very slightly. Yeah, yeah, so you just gotta like every fourth one go forward slightly, don't you? Yeah. yeah. Or you like, just like, That's, wait, that's the thing, wait. I don't think Brad's ever gone for it for that in his life prior to this. Oh no. So, yeah, McLeod's not happy about it. Um, he's probably not actually gone for the full just shine infinite in his life because if you're playing friendlies, you obviously go for something more difficult to try to practice it. But you got to practice that like once or twice to make sure you can hit it, right? I, yeah. And that's when you see the like top level foxes like Leff yeah. Leffen's doing the like, um, Wait, he, the, uh, to lose, not winners anymore. Oh yeah, yeah. you're right. Yeah. Um, 